The subscription service Movie Pass is scrambling to stay afloat. Consumers love it for making movie tickets affordable, but as Meg Oliver reports tonight, prices are going up. Emily Scheuer used her movie pass just a few days ago to see the Mamma Mia sequel. She's one of three million members who were paying $10 a month to see up to a movie a day in theaters. I've had it since January, so it's been six months, and I've probably used it to see 12 to 15 movies. Wow. But a few days ago, the bottom fell out when a cash crunch at MoviePass led to service outages. And it's this error making reservation. I don't know, it was pretty frustrating. Now the company is raising its rate by 50% to about $15 a month, and it's restricting tickets for major releases. That's what happened this weekend with the opening of the newest Mission Impossible. MoviePass holders were blocked from getting tickets. MoviePass explained the change in a message to its members that to continue growing, it needs to maintain a high level of financial discipline. Derek Thompson is senior editor at The Atlantic and says the model is flawed. It's not a business model. It is a consumer giveaway. They can use that card every single day to buy movie tickets, but MoviePass still has to pay full freight for each movie ticket. Shoyer says she's not sure she'll continue her membership after the price goes up. It's really frustrating when the problems happen, and so that's kind of a question that I'm in dealing with. But she says it was great during Oscar season. Meg Oliver, CBS News, New York. And the company that owns Movie Pass has watched its stock drop below a dollar. It's now in danger of getting booted off of the NASDAQ exchange.